Nolan, your excitement about the feeling right now this club has and the confidence. Well, we have come to spring training uh, extremely excited about our club and, and where we are coming into spring training. We feel like that uh, we had a very successful off season, and uh, I feel like our baseball guys were very creative in what they were able to do uh, with the restrictions that we had uh, uh, with our uh, um, our salary budget that we had, and we worked within that, and so I'm very proud of the job they've done. You know, Nolan, one of the biggest things, we talk to you every year about this, and especially last spring, you gave us some good names and some encouragement about some of the guys we might see, and sure enough, uh, the Tommy Hunters and the Derek Collins and some of these guys really stepped up. Where do you see those guys now this year? What are the expectations for those guys to compliment, obviously, Rich Harden? Well, the way I look at it is that uh, with the experience they got, uh, I'd like to think they grow and develop off of that. And uh, uh, we look at, at Tommy Hunter as obviously one of our starters. And, and uh, uh, Holland, we, uh, uh, is, he's competing for one of the starting mm -hmm. positions. And, and uh, uh, being left-handed, uh, he would fit in our bullpen if, if we felt like that that's where he could serve us best. So those are good problems to have that we, ha for the first time in this organization, uh, probably ever, have, we have – eight people vying for five starting spots and, and two or three of them are already taken and so the competition is going to be keen and, and the, the strength of that is is that those guys that don't make it uh, will be in AAA and as we well know Kevin mm -hmm. that uh, you have to have uh, reliable people that you can go to uh, when somebody goes down and, and you're not going to get by with five starters and so we feel like this is the first time we've had strength and some experience and so uh, if they don't go to to a triple A, they'll be the long guys in the bullpen, and so we feel real good about that. You know, no, no one else, you've been here, I think, on your third year, is that correct? That's correct. Third, third year, and we know what the philosophy is, which you know I agree with. We go way back, and I, I come from that school as well, where starters should be stretched out. How is it now? How is it uh, in the whole organization? Everybody seems to get it now, right? Well, <laughs> or do they? <laughs> no, I, I, I think that uh, with bringing Mike Maddox over last year and, and Mike and I being pretty much on the same page about that mm -hmm. and, and giving guys as much work as we can get them and then uh, uh, Jose Vasquez uh, with the conditioning side of it, we're all on the same page that way. And so uh, that's our philosophy, and, and we've stressed that throughout the mm -hmm. entire organization. The organization understands us. Everybody's on board with it. And so what we're seeing now is that we're throwing more all the way down to the A-ballers with the live BP, uh, uh, long toss, different things. So these guys realize that they can throw more than they've been accustomed to, mm -hmm. and they're not going to hurt themselves. We're going to make sure and get them ready physically to do what we asked them to do on the mound. And so they've bought into it, and now they believe they can do it.